Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Excel Doers. Uh, if you have not subscribed uh, our channel yet, please subscribe now and click the bell icon so you keep getting updates uh, on our all new upcoming videos. Okay, so this is the very first lecture of Excel learning and we will be starting from basic Excel to the myth to advanced level of Excel and then we will bring this course to the VBA and macros where you will be able to write efficient and effective Excel application to automate your daily task. Uh, before starting, the we need to learn uh, the basic concepts. Uh, what are basically uh, the Microsoft Excel is what are the workbook is what are the sheets are and what is the cell actually so starting from the Microsoft Excel uh, this is an application okay what is the application the question comes in our mind what uh, okay uh, what's the difference between an application and a workbook is workbook is really an application uh, the answer is no. Uh, Microsoft Excel is an application in which we open uh, the workbook. And workbook is a file which contains uh, the sheet's information. And each sheet contains multiple cells. So starting with application, so basically, when we install the Microsoft Office in our computer, uh, we install the Excel application. Without Excel application, we cannot open the workbook. So all the workbooks open in a single Excel application. When Excel is executed, you are allowed to open the Excel assets file and other extension as well. These XLSX is basically an extension which represent, okay, this file is supposed to be open in Excel application. Okay, so this is your application. Okay, uh, which contain all your workbooks. Workbook is a file or we can say the database which contain uh, many, uh, many set of data. Uh, the set of data we can define as a sheet so each workbook contain multiple sheets and each sheets contain multiple cells and in this particular cells we keep uh, all the important information okay uh, so in easy words if I stop the Excel application all the workbooks which are open will be closed altogether. If I remove a sheet here in workbook one, it will not affect my workbook two, or it won't be affecting the work sheet one or sheet three of the same workbook. Neither it's gonna affect the sale of any other sheets, but it's going to affect the sale of the same sheet which is being going to close. So I can say, okay, there are some information in the cell which stays in the sheet. And the sheet stays in the workbook and the workbook is staying uh, in the Excel. If I close this workbook, all these three sheets will be closed, but this will remain unaffected. But if I close this workbook too, uh, this will close all these three sheets and all the cells, but will not affect the workbook one. But if I kill the application, which is the Microsoft Excel, uh, it's going to kill both these workbook because the both of these workbooks are open in this Microsoft Excel so so in our example uh, this is the window you are seeing is an application in application we have open multiple worksheet workbook which you are seeing okay these are all different workbooks in each workbook we can have multiple sheets these are all sheets which are in a single workbook and these are the cells which can which are inside this sheet too and i can keep any information in the cell but if i remove this sheet too 
only the cell containing this sheet 2 will be removed but sheet 3 sheet 4 will not be affected sheet 1 will not be effective until unless i close the workbook or remove the sheet 1 okay so i am hopeful uh, you are clear with now what are the application what are the workbooks what are the sheets and what are the cells uh, if you have any question regarding this uh, please comment uh, below this video and i will respond